am so excited for today's video because I'm getting to do one of my all-time favorite things and that is junking. I love going around to different antique stores, boutiques, and shops just to inspire you guys and some of you like me can't travel that far away. So if you have found yourself here for the very first time, we are so glad to have you and if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Today's video is going to feature an adorable shop here in Carrollton, Georgia called The Nest. For those of you that aren't familiar, Carrollton is about an hour west of Atlanta. It's in Carroll County, Georgia. You locals may remember The Nest originally started out on Alabama Street and then it moved to Bradley Street, which is this photo here, which was across from the amphitheater and now it is on maple street <clears throat> it's in this really old factory warehouse this building was built in 1911. it was originally a cotton warehouse and if you do get to come out and visit plan on spending the day because there is so much to see and do here feathers and twigs is on this end which is another antique store that i am going to feature in a future video and then you have the nest on this end which is the store i'm going to feature today but this old warehouse, if you like that industrial vibe with the exposed brick and ductwork, you'll love this place. Here is an old photo from the 50s. Um, it was a hosiery mill. And then I heard at some point it was a Chanel bedspread factory, although I don't know for sure. And then we have CM Tanner. It's across the street. It's 129 years old. But I'm not going to talk through the whole thing. I want you guys to sit back and enjoy and be sure to stay until the end because we have the featured booth of this video and we'll have some more photos of this shop as well. So sit back and enjoy.
I hope you are enjoying the shop tour so far. If you do get a chance to visit the nest, be sure and tell Jenny that we sent you. Jenny Darks is the new owner. She also has two antique booths at different antique stores. One is called High Cotton in Woodbury, Georgia, and the other antique booth is called Mill Street broad mill street antiques oh my goodness i've got that confused i'm so sorry i'll have the links in the description below but the nest is located at 506 maple street in Carrollton. i'll also have that link the hours and all of that stuff so you guys be sure to come out to Carrollton. there's lots of good restaurants here lots to see and do and lots of fun shops i am drawn to old photos and when i saw this one my heart did a little pitter patter i love it when they include history and this one was framed in july 1933 at a total cost for a dollar sixty i just thought this was so sweet and of course i had to buy this old towel rack i just thought it was beautiful I'm not sure if this came off of a wash stand or if it was repurposed from something else into this towel rack, but it has the old rusty nails on the side. I loved all of the details and I just thought it was so beautiful. When I found it, I wanted to put it in my guest bathroom, but then I got it home and I was like, hmm, I think this will look good in the kitchen. So I just grabbed some things that I had around the house and just kind of did this cute, quick little vignette. Um, these are not my colors. I think they're beautiful, but I'm more, you guys know, I love neutral. <laughs> I'm a neutral girl, so I don't know. This may end up in my craft room to hold spools, but the featured booth for this video is Robin's in the Trundle Bed. I love her style. She has a gorgeous Etsy shop as well. I'm going to have her links in the description so you can go check out her booth in person or you can go to her Etsy shop but I'm going to let you guys sit back and enjoy the rest of the video. And if you liked this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and hit that like button. And we would love to have you subscribe to be notified the next time that we upload a video. Thanks so much. And we will see you guys in the next one.